Have you ever wondered why many companies want their employees to use VPNs to connect to the company network from outside or how is it possible to access blocked website using a VPN Let's find out more about these questions VPN stands for virtual private network as the name suggests it creates a private and secure connection over a public network Typically when you visit a website on the internet and do activities like uploading or downloading there are several entities that could potentially track what you are doing and the information you are sending and receiving let's take a look at who these groups could be if you are connecting to a website from your workplace network or a public wifi spot the people who manage the network might be able to watch and record what you are doing your internet service provider isp handles the network connection between your device and the website server technically they can see your data packets In certain situations government agencies have the legal authority to monitor internet traffic when security measures are lacking cyber criminals or malicious hackers can intercept and eavesdrop on your data packets and don't forget that the website you are connecting to also has access to the data packets they can keep records of the information you sent including your ip address and specific web pages you visit on their site Now let's see how a VPN can enhance your online privacy and security by hiding your data and online actions from these entities. Imagine you are at your computer wanting to access a specific website securely. Your journey begins with your device connected to the internet through your internet service provider ISP. When you use a VPN before your information travels from your device, it meets the VPN software you installed. This software encrypts and wraps your data in a secure tunnel. Your data now enters this virtual tunnel created by the VPN. It's like your information is traveling through a hidden passage. This tunnel shields your data from anyone trying to intercept or snoop on it, providing a crucial layer of security. Your ISP can still see that data is moving, but it can only see it in its encrypted form without being able to see the actual content. Your online activities remain hidden from your ISP's view. Next, your encrypted data travels from your device through this tunnel and emerges at the VPN server you are chosen to connect to. VPN servers are located in various parts of the world. Once your data reaches the VPN server, it exits the tunnel, shedding its encrypted form. At this stage, it appears as if it is originating from the location of the VPN server rather than your actual physical location. This feature can help you bypass geographical restrictions or maintain anonymity online. From the VPN server, your data continues its journey to the website you want to access. To the website, it appears as if the request is coming from the VPN server's location, not your own, effectively hiding your IP address from the website. The website processes your request and sends the response back to the VPN server. Once the VPN server receives the response, it encrypts it and sends it back through the secure tunnel to your device finally when the encrypted response arrives at your computer the vpn client decrypts it making the website's content accessible to you you can now browse the website download files or engage in any online activities all while maintaining the privacy and security provided by the vpn it not only hides your ip address from the website you are connecting to but also ensures that your online activities remain private and secure And this is the same reason you can access blocked website using a VPN. When governments block a website, they instruct your internet provider to block the traffic to that particular website. But when you use a VPN, your internet provider doesn't know the actual destination of your data. It is important to remember that while a VPN can hide your data and online actions from various groups, the VPN provider itself can access your data. Therefore, it is important to select a reliable VPN service. That's all for this video. We hope you found it helpful. Thanks for watching and we will see you in the next video.